Hello everyone, welcome to the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, I will guide you about the view of MVC. Here is the view in our application, which is contained of account, home, manage, and shared folder. We have two types of views. The one is associated to the specific controller and the one is the generic view which is associated with all the pages or controller. Like here, uh, when I will execute my application, it will execute automatically the home view. And in Solution Explorer, we will go to the home. And here we have three pages index, which is the by default, the first page appear on the screen, contact and about. Here is the index page. Like when I will click on the index page. It will appear like this. The view is consist of HTML, CSS, JavaScript, jQuery, and front end technology. Here you will observe a code which represent the name of the page as home page, which you can view here home page. And this shows that it is in C sharp programming language. Normally, it's known as the razor syntax in ASP web development. Look here, here is written ASP.NET. I can easily change that without stop and restart the application because the view is executing on the client side not on the server side we have to stop the execution of the project when we have to change anything in asp project because the server side code needs a break but the client side code doesn't need the break like i am going to change the asp into the the, the engineering projects like I will change at the engineering projects and I have control save and when I will refresh that the content here get changed like this okay so you can easily manipulate the front end data without stop and restarting the whole project the view is all about the interface which is shown to the user when the project is access, accessed. Like here, these are all the uh, HTML which is used to represent something on the screen. Now here is the point. I have already mentioned that there are two kind of views. The first is which is specifically associated with the controller and second is the generic one. This view is the specifically associated with the controller representing that this is the content which have to be shown on the home page but you will observe in interface there is a menu but in the code there is not any point where you can observe it look like a menu so where is the actual menu is really exist and that is in the shared folder if we have to apply some generic terms in front end like menu footer sidebars or the theme layout 
we will use underscore layout or these others are the partial views which will specifically render on specific times like I will click on the layout and it will represent me the menu bar and the top header and here is the ending of the HTML page but in the index bar there are only divs available but not front and bottom uh, sorry top and bottom here is the top bottom and each and everything is available but there is a little thing also available which is known as render body in my upcoming video tutorial i will completely guide you about the render body in details but right now you must have to know that render body will graph or extract the code of each page and show within this div tag okay so when we will uh, use a view we will mention that we are using this layout and this layout will automatically adjust by visual studio like uh, each and every page will automatically extract the code and replace with the render body in the front end in the front end front end mean the user interface so i hope this video tutorial is informative for you about the view in mvc if you have any kind of question regarding this you can ask us and don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel to get more amazing video tutorials about asp.net application development Take care.